Hello everybody, Nettie Owens here, Safari Solutions. Um, I'm having my own aha moment and maybe you can relate. It is hotter than heck here in Maryland and the AC went out in my house. Um, and I'm so thankful for my fabulous connections that I've made through years in business. Um, so first response heating and cooling is coming out to remedy the problem. And I realized um, that I'm just so fortunate. I'm so fortunate to have made these business friends, um, to make these, make these connections such that I could just pick up the phone, reach out and say, you know what, this is the problem I'm having and somebody was available that I know and trust to remedy the situation. Um, and I was thinking too about how fortunate I am just to have a business. Um, and I, I'm guessing this is similar for you as well. You're not in business just to make money. Um, if you were in business just to make money, then you probably wouldn't be in business for very long, right? And you can make money like a million different ways. There are easier ways to make money than to go into business for yourself. Um, so those of you who are watching this that are in business and uh, you're probably thinking about your own reason, right, for going into your particular occupation. Um, and why I want to talk about that is, like I said, there's a million ways to make money, but you decided to open a business and do it that way. And there are days where you look at some it's not but if you're not in business to make money and you're not making money, then um, you need to think about that a little bit, right? So here's the deal and why I'm coming on to you live today. Just one moment. I'm going, by the way, I'm in business for myself and I'm in business in my house. <laughs> um, at the moment, I do have another office, but right now I'm here at home. Uh, thank goodness, summer vacation, right? The kids raiding the refrigerator. That might be why you're in business, right? So that you can be home. Hi. Um, so here what I want to talk to you about is this. There's probably a time in your life where you sat down and you wrote goals for what you would like to accomplish. These are mine, right? 10 exponential growth activities for the year. And, um, well, how are you doing on your goals? How are you doing on your exponential growth activities? Are you spending time on a daily basis working on these activities? And if you're not, why not? This is what I'd like to do with my exponential growth activities at the moment. Why am I doing this? Well, here's the deal. You, if you're like me, have wrote those goals six months ago, a year ago, 18 months ago, two years ago. Things have changed a little bit. It's time to think about a reset. It's time to think about where you are now and creating a life and goals around that. Um, if you are looking to grow an enormous amount in 2018, if you have big plans for your future, and you need some support and assistance, a framework to get that done so that you will hold yourself to it, then I have an event that was created just for you. It's called Reset, and it's happening July 23rd. So I want to personally invite you to attend. It's not just your vision board kind of activity, although we are going to talk about vision. And it's not just another goal setting class, although we will talk about goal setting you're actually going to have time to come up with your vision and your plan. And not only that, you will begin implementation on that particular day. But here's the really fabulous thing that I'm most excited about. You're going to have the support to make it actually happen. How many times do you go to a conference, go to a workshop, you get great information, and you come back and it gets put on the shelf. As my friend Chris likes to say, it's shelf help, right? It just gets put back and you never actually get around to implementing. So we're gonna implement on July 23rd. And on July 24th, you will be enrolled in the Momentum Program to ensure that every single day you are taking steps to make that vision and plan that you created for yourself at the reset event happen so that at the end of 2018, you can say you actually accomplished your goals. You don't have to rip them to shreds because 
what happened, you've changed, everything changed, you're going to be held to that. I want you to imagine for just a few moments the reality of your life if you actually accomplished the things that you vision for yourself today. What would life be like? You would not only be earning money, right? But maybe you'd be able to work from home. Maybe you would be able to handle it when the air conditioning blows out and suddenly you need to be able to say, yeah, I got that. I can do this. I can cover this for my family. So being in business is not, is not just to make money, but making money means that you can provide for your family and have the things and comforts around you that make you feel great. And maybe it's about contributing to a charitable organization. Maybe it's about having to volunteer. Any of those things are possible for you. So what you need to do now is go to launch2018.com and check out the details for the reset event. Ask me any questions that you have. If you're not sure if this is the right fit for you, then schedule a time to talk, and I'll be happy to answer any questions that you might have that are coming up. I look forward to seeing you there and to all that you will accomplish this year. Bye.